the most important thing is the love that we share. No other thing trumps that. Right. And again, as you said, even if the romantic side of our connection were to no longer serve one of us, we've made certain that that's not going to trump the love that we have for each other. And that's so important because I love you, all of you, as you are. And if for any reason you felt that this was this connection that we have was limiting your growth, then because I love you, I would never desire to hold you back in any capacity. And so having a plan in place that allows us to know we can decouple in the most loving way and both walk into a new aspect or a new phase of our lives, holding on to that love and that connection. It just allows us to, as you said, kind of settle into the love of it and not the fear that something is going to happen. So, so important. And fear is such a huge part of life for so many right now, right? In all aspects, whether it's politics or uh, you know, just education, life. just like, yeah, I mean, you can name just all life. the topics. Uh, yeah. It is, and it's, it's marketed, which is the other problem, right? And so we're, 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 we're reacting based on fear. And your relationship is, at least from my perspective, I feel like our relationship is supposed to be our safe place. It's not supposed to be uh, the, the place of fear. It's supposed to be that safe place where we feel that we are seen, heard, and gotten. And within that, it's a place for me to seek to understand that of myself. I know that when I talk to you, you know, one moment I may understand myself as this, and through the process of talking something deep with you, then I might understand myself as that. You know, whatever it is, it's different. But that, that's a special, beautiful space that allows me to grow and expand and know myself at another level, right? And I'm really, really fortunate that I've gotten to do that over the last decade with you. And I, and I feel very sad that it seems like a lot of people don't get that experience within their relationships. And that's, so if we can really focus on making that partnership be a really strong, safe place for each other, then, then it does feel free. And, and love is free in that sense. Like it, it's, it's not binding. It's not expectation. It's not shame or guilt or all these really low vibrational things that just makes it feel like control and fear. It's joy. It's, it's fun. It's light. You know, it's trust. It's transparency. Things that feel light and bright and, and bubbly, <laughs> you know, and it doesn't mean we, we don't have our hard times, but it also, we don't get stuck in them and they don't drag us down. 